Young boy in Minot is taking his love for basketball to another level. While in elementary school, he started a basketball camp for the youth while also giving back to the community he calls home. Adina Balthazor has more. When Joshua Groninger was in second grade, he approached his parents with the idea of starting a basketball camp for kids. He wanted to call it Camp Jack, Joshua's athletic camp for kids. His relationship with his sister is what sparked the conversation. I just love basketball and I enjoyed te like playing with my sister, I guess. It was what really gave me the idea and then my parents just made it all happen basically. So. For the last eight years, Joshua, with the help from his dad and friends, have put on Camp Jack for kids between the age of three and six years old, teaching them all the basics from dribbling to defending. We do shooting, dribbling, passing, defense, and then they just, we just basically have this little shoot around at the end of the practice, or end of the camp, so. Joshua said they had 30 kids in their first year, and since then, the camp has doubled in size. His father, Darren, says he has a blast every year. I've always enjoyed sports, and especially basketball. It's in the middle of winters in North Dakota, I don't know what would be better to do, actually, than to spend time in a gym, so, um, it's just a lot of fun for me. I, I love kids and they're having so much fun and, and the parents get a good time, have a good time watching them too. So it's just all around a good, good thing. When this first started, Joshua's parents told him all the money would be given to a nonprofit. So they picked the Dakota Hope Clinic and have been giving back to them every year since. They, they actually started the camp without us even knowing and didn't even, just all of a sudden we received the proceeds and I was like, what, you know, and then I had no idea that the camp was even going. And so they kind of took the initiative, which I love. Joshua says he's excited to see the kids and the excitement they bring every year. He adds he never thought Camp Jack would be at the level it is, and it's all thanks to the support from the community. It's super fun. I enjoy doing it. So it's a big thank you because without people showing up and without people registering, I mean, it filled, it filled up the, la the last couple of years in like two weeks, maybe. Reporting in Minot for KX Sports, I'm Adina Balthazor. What a great story. Joshua and his dad say they plan to have this again next year. For more information, you can head over to our website, kxnet.com.